right so so in the previous session we discussed about a program to find the index number of all occurrences of the same character right that's fine now we'll see a new program that is a list is there in the list uh, some elements are there guys some numbers are there okay a list is there a list is there in the list uh, some elements are there like uh, for example some random numbers like this all of you some random numbers are available okay uh, something like this let's take uh, some number 11 and some number uh, 15 I'll take, for example, here something 18, like this, some numbers. Okay, now, so here, what is the, what are the missing values? What are the missing values from this list? I want to display those numbers. So how to find what are the missing values? How do you define, sir, what is the minimum and what is the maximum means? So in this list, what is the minimum value? What is the minimum value, right? Four is the minimum, right? Minimum value, guys. What is the maximum value here? 20 is the max, right? Maximum value. So starting value for ending value 20, between these two numbers, uh, there are some numbers available. There are some numbers available, which are between uh, these two. And whatever missed, whatever missed, uh, those numbers I want to display, right? For example, after four, five should come. So five is not there, right? Five is not there. So, so sorry. So five is not there. I want to get uh, five. I want to get the five. Next, uh, uh, six also not there, right? Six also not there, guys. I want to get the six. So five, six, not is missed. Seven is there, eight, eight also not there, right? Eight also not there, nine is there, 10 is there, 11 is there, and uh, 12 is not there, 13 is there, and uh, so 13 is not there, right, guys? So 13 uh, is not there, right? Not there. 14 also not there, and uh, 15 is there, 16 is there, 17 also not there, 18 is there. 19 also not there so these are the numbers which are missing uh, in this list guys in this list as for the starting and the sorry beginning and the are min and max values as for the min and max values uh, these are missing right from this given list so 5 6 8 12 13 okay and uh, 17 19 right uh, yes let us try guys now how to get it. So first, uh, what we do, we take the, what is the minimum value from the list? And what is the maximum value from the list? Okay. I'll take uh, max of list, right? Max of list into a variable called, uh, right? Minimum number, guys, sorry. Maximum, right, guys? I take the max number, the max number. We'll take uh, min of list, uh, min of list, which is a uh, min number, right? Minimum number. What's the max number, guys? Here, what's the max number? The max number is from the given list uh, 20. The min number is from the given list uh, is 4, right? It's the 4. It is the 4, right? The min number, max number. <clears throat> now, so what do I do from this list? I fetch one by one, guys. Or, uh, from this range uh, between these two numbers, 4 and 5, I fetch one by one. I fetch one by one and I check uh, that is available or not in the list. If not available, then I want to append to the new list, guys. I repeat. So we know the start value, we know the end value, right? Or we know min value, max value. So between these, I'll take one by one, like I take the uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and so on, one by one from four onwards. That each one check here, it's available or not here. If not available, then take to the new list, right? So means I want to generate the numbers between these two numbers, guys. I want to generate all numbers between uh, the starting and ending numbers, right? 
we take for i in uh, for i in uh, range of what start number start number is uh, i take the variable name minimum n number is a uh, okay maximum guys minimum maximum minimum right minimum maximum just uh, let me print the i guys if you print the i we get all the numbers between these two right <clears throat> we get from from 4 to 19 right guys we get from 4 to 19 now. 4 to 19, right? 19, guys. All 20 is available, right? 20 is available in the given list. Okay, fine. All of right. Uh, I think the 4 hours is not required because already 4 is the minimum, right, guys? I want after 4 onwards, right? I want to check after 4 onwards. Means of, after 4 means what, guys? 5 onwards, okay? Up to which one? I want to check up to up to what here up to 19 guys i want to check up to 19 i want to check up to up to 19 okay 19 guys so maximum means a max minus one right we'll take the min plus one guys min plus one min will be so four so four i want to get five onwards if you take four also no problem but already four is available right so check the next number onwards so five onwards okay now let me run this one so yes, we got it now. Okay, so now five to nineteen, guys. Right, five to nineteen, we got it. All the numbers between uh, this max and ma uh, min and max values. Now from this one, uh, first take the first i value five and uh, check it uh, is it available or not in the given list. If not available, then up into the new list, guys. Next, uh, next value six is coming. Uh, that we check here is available or not available. If not in this list, that I value not in the list that I want to display, right? So we check it now, guys. Here, if that I value not not okay, not in list. If not available, then I want to take it. Okay, I want to take it. That's all. Then uh, let me take the list comprehension. So print off list, right? Print off list. Yes. So these are the numbers uh, which are not available in the given list, guys. So all of you observe, what are the numbers I wrote here? The same numbers, guys, right? You can see, okay, uh, yes, same output came, right? Five, comma, six, comma, eight, comma, 12, comma, 13, comma, that's all. This is the output I expected, uh, same coming as this, guys, okay? So this is the way how to find uh, the missing numbers, right? So the program, let's take, I think, number 40, right? Uh, 40, guys. So write a program, write a program to find, to find the missing numbers, right? Missing numbers, numbers from the list, from the list that is based on the min value, max value, guys. Okay, all of you. So this is the one of the ways to find the uh, the missing values, right? Yeah, thank you all of you guys, bye.